Hier geht Kinsha. Unsa? I must go on a question. Kinsa? We have our new friends who are joining us here in Kinsha. So be ready and excited for... Kinsha! Hello Kids Jammers, I am Ria Garo and I am so excited to learn with you here at Kids Jam, Jesus and Me, Season 7! Hello mga Kids Jammers, I am Adelini and I am so excited to learn with you here at Kids Jam, Jesus and Me, Season 7! Hello Kids Jammers, I am Ate Faith and I am so excited to learn with you here at Kids Jam, Jesus and Me, Season 7! Hello Kids Jammers! I am Ate Nice and I am so excited to learn with you here at Kids Jam, Jesus and Me, Season 7! Hello Ate Faith! Um, what are you doing? I'm reading my book with Ate Ling. What are you doing? The Bible! Kaya gusto ko mong learn about Jesus. Tama dyan natin, Faith. We should read the Bible to learn more about Jesus. Ako, gusto po kong makalearn more about Jesus. Kamu, Chris Jammers, do you want to learn more about Jesus? Join us here at Chris Jam, Jesus and Me, Season 7!
so excited ay magpadayo na lang ta na season 7 of Kids Jam. Ako pag Kuya Card, excited na kayo ko. Pero nakulubuan mo ko kahit wala tayo kauban ng mga ate ka ron. Bitaw ang tehili no, kita lang ka ron. Pero magpadayo niya ang punta sa rest ka na Biblical Purpose, the power of Biblical Telling. Yes, Telling. New word na ako natunan last week, which means being directed or tending toward a goal or purpose, meaning purposeful. Biblical Telling is Biblical Purpose. Let's say it again, this jammer, with action. Biblical Purpose. I get my kiss jammers. Biblical but before anything else, let us acknowledge our presence at umuhin na gino through prayer. Tama ka ni Faith. Dali kids jammers, let's clap our hands, let's bow our head, and close our eyes and pray. Lord Jesus, we thank you Lord for this day. And Lord, we pray Lord that we will be able to understand your word and be blessed by it. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen! Karun? Join our kids travel friends and let's worship our Lord Pinaagi sa atong pagkata and sayo Ready na ba mo kids jammers? If ready na, let us say Amen! Amen!
We will share to you about the pictures and we will ask some questions later. This is Apostle Paul. God used Apostle Paul para mag-share sa pulong si Tinoo. Dahil nakaila si Tinoo dahil kay Apostle Paul. Apostle Paul traveled the world to share God's word. Three times na shipwrecked si Apostle Paul and now may time na nag-spend si Apostle Paul days and nights na nagluto-luto sa daga. Nag-journey po si Apostle Paul, very long days, hard trials, pulay tulog, butong, uhaw, grabe na kakapoy, and even maglakaw na tublong kaayo just to be able to share God's words sa mga tao. Tagal po na nakalaman kay Apostle Paul. One time, kibato siya hangtod sa abi nila na patay na siya. Pero sa kusog sa ginoo, nitindog siya to continue to share God's word. Three times si Apostle Paul po at kay Kikulata o mga kahoy. Five times gilatiw siya with 13 and lashes. Nag-suffer siya for the gospel. At the end sa life ni Apostle Paul, nakulong siya. Pero habang nakulong siya, dito siya nagsulat sa mga believers na hantod ka rin magbasagyan kung nato sa Bible. Apostle Paul was a soldier for Jesus. Dagan ka ay siya sa parents na ni Kotro para ma-share ang pulong sa Ginoo at karoon. Kita po at makalungo sa pulong sa Ginoo dahil sa pag-suffer ni Apostle Paul for the gospel. Amazing ka ay si Paul. Pero it's jammers, kung sa inyong napansin sa life ni Paul. Yes mga kids jammers, dagan ka yung suffer si Paul. Bisod pa rin ka ayo, shipwreck. This is the travels, Gibato, Gikolong, Gikolata. Why do you think that he went to Nepal? Makita nato ang reason ni Paul in all these things in the Bible. In the book of Colossians 1, 24 to 29, ang first na reason is to proclaim Jesus. Gusto ni Paul na ipailaila si Jesus sa tanan ng tao. Second, is to warn everyone. Dagat kayo ng mga tao na wala sila kabalong na may affair sila if wala si Jesus in their life. So Paul wanted to warn them. Third, is to teach everyone. Ang goal ni Paul kay tabangan ang mga tao na makasagot sa pulong sa ginoo. And the last one, kay to present everyone to plead. Di niya kay dawatan natin sa Jesus sa atong life Pa, but transform and maging mature niya sa ginoo. And Paul wanted to help the believers na maging mature sa ilang faith.
and my heart's defender. Yeah, you are the prize. Hapit na 
natin maabot si Ate Amy sa finish line. The link is jammer. For one last time, ubali ka yung jump. Ready? Let's jump! One, two, three, four, five, six. Finishing well. It means being faithful in keeping the faith. Hindi tayo mag stop. And we will always be with the Lord and always do the will of the Lord. Don't put ko sa finish line. Thank you, Kalikis Chalmers! Apostle Paul said, I have fought the good fight, I have finished the race, and I have kept the faith. We have learned kung diun sa ipag endure ni Apostle Paul, ipinaagi sa ating jam na ro. Sober mindedness in all things, resilience and endurance, trust and obedience, faithful Christian service. Finishing well. Salamat kayo, Kiss Jammers! It's time for Jambalai! For our Jambalai today, we will be doing Apostle Paul Art. Let's watch this video. Hello, Kids Jammers! For our Jambalai today, we will need a paper, marker, and some crayons. First, magdraw ta line sa baba sa papel. Then, we will draw an upside down U. And, i connect nato siya sa line and maoni ang body sa atong disciple. Then, magdraw ta og circle para sa ulo sa atong disciple. Tapos, para sa atong arms, magdraw ta og gamay na U shape sa sulod sa body. Then, draw a line from one side of the body and also the other side. Tapos, i connect nato sila by drawing a line. And para sa atong hands, which should look like they are folded together, magdraw lang taog line or semicircle na gamay. Now, let's draw our disciple's belt. You can design it with lines and patterns, just like sa gibuhat din hiya sa video. Then, we will draw a head covering and a headband for the disciple. So just like this. Then, putin po nato og line ang headband pareho sa atong belt. Then, we will finish off with his face. Of course, nakasmile ang disciple ni Jesus. And that's it for our Apostle Paul Art Jambalai. Don't forget to send us your pictures and unleash the creativity in you. Bye-bye, Kids Jammers! Apostle Paul finished the race and kept the faith, for he has biblical purpose! You so what? We're like Apostle Paul, we can do it all if we focus on Jesus! Tantanan, dito want to share to everyone the love of Jesus. We must live a purpose-driven life in Jesus. Remember, we are called to life of authentic discipleship and intentional disciple making. And practice the culture of punctuality and stewardship. Bata kung ka, lalaki or babae, maski asa magkakaroon, we should honor God and di magsigi una una unsa yun ay isip sa uban tao. Send your jumbling pictures and be a blessing to all. Until next time, kids jumpers, uban ko ta, mukha ta, musayaw, magpership, magtuon sa pulong sa ginoo, and practice the culture of punctuality.